Hey guys, Melissa here. I'm excited to show you what I discovered as a way to coil really long coils without getting all tangled up and stuff. It's these swivels here. I purchased some of these ball bearing fishing swivels. I just put like a key ring in between them to hook them together. I put two on here in case something happens to this one, this back one can take over. I already had this vise here in the garage. It's my husband's, he doesn't use it, so I took it of course. And don't mind the mess, but it is the same height as my drill. What I'm doing now is I, you know, I cut off a, a nice long two foot piece of wire to coil on my for my base wire. I just put it in my swivel here and the swivel keeps it nice and straight so I can coil on it. And off the end of my table here, I have a coiling gizmo. Got a coiling gizmo there, which I've just ended up putting my spool on. It's got my 28 gauge here. I've got a 26 gauge here and I'm gonna go ahead and cut off just to show you how long I can go. I'm gonna cut off a nice three foot piece. So I'm going to take my 28 gauge, incorporate it to my, kind of twist it on the end of my 26 gauge here, an angle on this here. Stick that in one of the sides, have the wire come out the middle. Just going to go more like that. I'm so excited about this. It's going to make things so much easier and so much faster and more efficient. So I kind of lock that in. Grab your base wire. Actually you learn this from the vape guys. I guess they make their own coils. Over here I'm gonna, I'm gonna twist the end of this wire onto the swivel. I'm gonna pull it tight from the drill. You can see it's still attached to the drill. All right, and just like you would a regular coil, just start coiling. At times I gotta pull out some wire so it doesn't get hung up. Snip this off. Snip the loop off this. Take my end of the out of that drill and unwind it. Clean it up a bit. All right. So I'm gonna measure. I got. 23, 32 inches of coil. Now this is 
26 gauge core, 28 gauge coil. Look at all that. And it was so fast and so efficient and so excited. And I wanted to share with you all. Nice, clean, tight coil. All right, so that's it for me. What'd you guys think? You think you'll go out and get some swivels? Uh, I definitely would recommend it. Look at all these coils. I use the same technique to coil my coils to make one of these. This has a core of, what did I use? 22 gauge with the same 28 gauge coil. I attached the 22 gauge to my swivel and I made this super long coil. This one is about seven inches. So there you go. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit the like button if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.